Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Now since I uploaded a Japan vlog last week, I thought I would continue with the theme a little bit and do some poppin' cooking. Now if you don't know what poppin' cooking is, it's basically this Japanese thing where you make candy out of packets of powder and water. <laughs> so for example, this one you can make sushi shaped candy out of it. And this one's a little bit more interesting. You can make some omelet and tempura and meatballs out of it. I'm not doing it to try and eat it because apparently it doesn't taste very good. <laughs> but I thought it'd be fun to try it out. So let's get started. Hi, I'm sorry about this angle, but this is the best I can do. Uh, I'm gonna start off with the sushi ones. I've got my little packet here and some water because apparently that's all you need the instructions are all in japanese so i'm either just gonna have to look at the pictures or look it up in english because they are, they do have instructions in english here is basically everything you get i've got my little mold here to make sushi shape things <laughs> And these are the packets of powder I was talking about. And I even have this little suction cup for my water. And it even has a little presentation plate that you can cut out from the packaging. Okay, I got it, I got it. Put the water enough to fill the oval shape here. This is supposed to make the rice or make it look like rice. And I have a little spatula here. Oh my God, it smells like ramune or ramune. You know that Japanese dr carbonated drink? Oh my God, it smells so good. It says, be careful not to spill the powder outside of the tray, <laughs> which I have already done. Then we're supposed to make the egg roll. Ooh, that's a different smell. Oh no, ugh. <laughs> oh god, it's so bad at staying inside the lines. Oh, it smells like grape. Next, make the tuna. The hardest part is spreading this out. Then, make seaweed. That's passable. What next? Make salmon eggs. Ooh, this is the best part. What? Oh my god, it's doing it. What? What is this sorcery? Look! It's formed into little balls or eggs, whatever you want to call it. Okay, it says now let's make sushi. So I'm supposed to form the rice. Oh my god, it actually feels fluffy. That is so weird. Ha ha! Oh my god! That is sushi! Then I'm gonna take some more rice and I'm gonna make the tuna one. <gasps> Look at that! I think that looks pretty close. Okay, next we're gonna make the salmon egg sushi. I'm trying my best, y'all. Oh my god, this is a pile on the salmon eggs. Oi! What? Look at this! So I made my soy sauce. So I just had to do some close-up shots of these because this is just too cute. Look at that. You see the ridges on there? It actually looks like tuna. And this salmon egg. Oh my god, look at that. And then we have the egg one. Doesn't it actually look like a freaking plate of sushi? I'm gonna do a little taste test of my sushi here. I'm not very excited because... I've been touching this. Okay, I'm gonna try this salmon egg first. Actually, I'm just gonna try one of the eggs. It just tastes like sugar. Like pure sugar, no flavor. Let's try the seaweed. Seaweed is nice. I mean, it's the only thing we didn't make. <laughs> now I'm gonna try the little tuna. The rice really does taste like ramune. The tuna doesn't really taste like anything. 
Oh, the texture is awful. It's not as bad as I thought it would be. Okay, now let's try the egg here. This one smelled like grape, so I'm thinking it's gonna taste like grape. No, it doesn't taste like grape. Oh, let me try a little bit of the soy sauce. doesn't taste like anything. I have this other packet here, but this took me a while to do, so I think I will save this for a rainy day. If you want to try and do one of these things, I bought this from a Japanese grocery store. Okay, yeah, well that's pretty much it. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see y'all later. Bye!